If destiny comes to help you, love will come to meet you. A life without love isn't a life. God doesn't take it into account. Every second that unravels far from love is a source of shame before the Lord. And when you leave this house at last, you'll only be able to carry what weighs nothing. The time that passes in the torment of love will reveal itself tender as the patience of a father. And the poverty you are ashamed of now will be for you an honor in the other world. Although the bitterness of patience is suffocating, It'll become, in the end, a wonder of joy. And when the lion of the spirit escapes his cage, he will run towards the fields of splendor. And when he descends from this donkey's carcass, the king of the heart will be a king of rapture. Only spread out the hem of the robe of effort, a rain of gold, will pour from heaven. Whoever doesn't show himself humble today will tomorrow be humiliated like Pharaoh. Whoever isn't transformed like the rose into rose water will be cast like thorns into the fire. There is a window between heart and heart. They are never separate like two bodies. Two lamps may not be united in their form, but their light merges into each other. No lover ever searched for union if his beloved is not also seeking him. The love of lovers makes them thin, the Beloved's love makes them full and shining. When the lightning of love for the Beloved falls from heaven and strikes this heart, know that love is also firing that heart. And when the love for him brims over in your heart, know that love for you is also brimming over in his. Can the sound of clapping come only from one hand when a thirsty man moans, O oh, water, O oh, delicious water, this thirst that is in all our souls is the water drawing us always to it. We belong to it, and it belongs to us. Each moment, from all sides, rushes to us the call to love. We are running to contemplate its vast green field. Do you want to come with us? This is not the time to stay at home, but to go out and give yourself to the garden. The dawn of joy has arisen, and this, this is the moment of union, of ecstasy, of vision. Oh, King, master of this time, awaken from your drugged sleep, straddle the horse of joy. It is here, it is here the moment of our reunion. The drum of the coming true of promises is beating. The pathway of heaven is being swept. Your joy is now, and what remains for tomorrow is ash. The horses of day have put to flight the armies of the night and heaven and earth are full of the purity of the divine light. You are my soul, my universe, 
What do I have to do with the soul and the universe? For me, you are ever-flowing treasure. What do I have to do with profit or loss? One minute I am the friend of the wine, another the friend of him who burns me. I have come to this age of ruins, so what do I have to do with time's melodrama? I am terrified by the whole world. I am sprung free of the whole world. I am neither hidden nor apparent. What do I have to do with existence or space? I am drunk on union with you. I need and I want and I care about no one else. Since I am your prey, what do I care about fate's bow and its arrows? I live at the bottom of the stream. Why would I go looking for water? What could or would I say about this stream that flows and flows and flows? I have given up existence. Why go on staggering under the burden of this mountain? Since the wolf is my shepherd, why put up with the pretensions of the shepherd? What a abandon, what drunkenness. You hold the cup in your hand. Blessed, blessed is the place you are and glorious to the eye of the heart. Each atom by your grace is a universe, each drop of water a soul, and no one who has ever had a sign from you need worry again about name or sign. To find the place of splendor at the bottom of the sea of truths, you have to dive, you have to dive head first. What do I have to do with feet that scurry? With the sword of the one God, you have hacked a path for us. You have stolen all my clothes. What will I give to the tall man? From your beauty, a blaze like the sun, from the curls of your hair, my heart has become ecstatic. Oh, my soul, hand me this brimming cup. Do not weigh pain and misery. Contemplate love, contemplate friendship. Do not mull over tyranny and neglect. Think of all those who have their eyes fixed on you. Surname all grief, grace. Transmute pain and anguish into joy. And ask from joy all happiness, all security, all peace. Demand that security. Demand that peace. Demand them. And choose the company of those withdrawn in love. Listen, listen to those who open a path to you. Listen, and don't say a word. intellect says the six directions are limits there is no way out love says there is a way I have traveled it thousands of times the intellect saw a market and started to haggle Love saw thousands of markets beyond that market. Lovers who drink the dregs of the wine reel from bliss to bliss. The dark-hearted men of reason burn inwardly with denial. The intellect says, do not go forward. Annihilation contains only thorns. Love laughs back, the thorns are in you. Enough words. Silence. Pull the thorn of existence out of the heart fast. For when you do, you will see 
thousands of rose gardens in yourself. Oh love, oh pure deep love, be here, be now. Worlds dissolve into your stainless, endless radiance. Frail living leaves burn with you brighter than cold stars. Make me your servant, your breath, your core. Love does not live in science and learning or in any careful order of pages and letters. Whatever people chatter about is not the way of lovers. The branches of love are in pre-eternity, its roots in the post-eternal. This is a tree that does not exist on any supports of heaven or earth. We have dethroned reason and we have imprisoned desire. For the majesty of divine love cannot live with such fools and their habits. So long as you hunger after anything, what you long for will be an idol. When love decides to love you back, you will no longer exist. All sailors totter on planks of fear and of hope, but when planks and sailor have vanished, what remains but drowning? Shams of Tabriz, you are sea and pearl. The mystery of your being is the secret of the Creator. My soul, the first time I saw you, my soul heard wonders from your soul. And when my heart drank water from your fountain, it drowned in you, and the river swept me away. There's no cure except the retreat into love for the suffering of subtly afflicted hearts. See the friend directly, or burn in longing for him. What does the whole world matter apart from that? To arrive at last at the vision of the friend, keep your soul prostrate before the image you have of him. Stay standing before him like the foot of a lamp. A thousand graces are poured out to the noble. In this contingent universe, you are powerless. When will you find the origin of time? When physical vision has transcended space, another sky opens to the eyes of the soul. Your body is a saucepan, the soul its food. Place this pan on the fire of divine passion so its flames can make boil the truth within you. Then you won't need anyone else's poems or teachings. You yourself will know the value of your state of soul. Give me ecstasy. Give me naked wonder. O oh, my Creator, give birth to the Beloved in me. 
and let this lover die. Let a thousand wrangling desires become one love. This ring of desire I wear is the seal of Solomon. I know I have it only on loan, so I never take it off. The years of repentance are over. A new year has come that shatters and destroys a thousand regrets a day. If you never knew this vertigo, this mad spring will make you totter. Oh, love, you are the universal soul, crown and jail, all at once. At once the prophets call an our lack of belief. Love, you have created us with thirsty hearts. You have bound us to the source of splendor. For you my thorns have blossomed, my atoms embraced the worlds. Contemplating in my leaping atoms the universe makes my days stagger and sob with wonder. Look, the wine is in the green grape, existence in nothingness. Joseph, I beg you, see in your pit the crown and the kingdom. A thorn that has not blossomed cannot illumine the field. How can a being made of water and clay find life if divine breath does not itself kindle it? Clap your hands, clap your hands again, and know each sound has its origin in the wine's own self-surrender. Be silent now, be silent. Spring is here, the rose is dancing with its thorn. Beauties have come from the invisible to call you home. Give me ecstasy. Give me naked wonder, O oh my Creator. Give birth to the Beloved in me, and let this lover die.